how hard oh, great to see ya! <laughs> Yo, what is up there, guys? I was back again with another video with some, another Kingdom Hearts 3 discussion video. That's what we're we'll talking about right here, right now. So let's get right to it. All right, so of course today's topic is going to be about Agrabah. You know, that good old Agrabah that's been in almost every single Kingdom Hearts game. But will it appear in Kingdom Hearts 3? You know, I was pretty confident, but now I'm starting to become a little bit skeptical, mainly because of how things are turning out. We know that we're going to be getting less Disney Worlds than we did had in Kingdom Hearts 2. Kingdom Hearts 2, of course, had 12 Disney world and as of right now we have seven worlds confirmed we've got olympus we've got pirates frozen big hero 6 monsters inc tangled and toy story so we have two returning worlds out of the seven at the moment right now one classic animated version and of course a live action movie so agrabah would definitely fit in with another animated movie over here but i don't really know my whole thing about agrabah at this point is the fact that you know we are doing a whole new seven princesses of heart now we already have the confirmation of rapunzel El Elsa, Anna, and Kyrie, which means we have three more slots left for three potential princesses. And then some people are kind of making the argument that, like, Boo might be one of the seven princesses of heart, which, you know, that kind of makes sense. She's a child. She's the most purest thing above, above of anything within the Kingdom Hearts series right now at the moment. But those three slots could potentially mean the last three worlds could involve the new princesses. Now, of course, my money would definitely be, like, Tiana, Merida, and I really don't know who the third one could be. It could potentially be another world focus on the princess or maybe not because as you may recall when we played Kingdom Hearts 1 uh, we didn't even visit half the princesses when we saw them in Hollow Bash and half of them were already there like we had Snow White we had Aurora but we didn't actually visit their world prior to meeting them in Hollow Bash and I'm talking about Kingdom Hearts 1 I ain't talking about like you know birth by sleep or anything like that so since Jasmine, of course, is a seventh uh, princess, and we're not dealing with any of the old ones. I'm starting to think that maybe we won't see Agrabah because of that. Now, of course, Agrabah doesn't have to be mainly focused on Princess Jasmine. She had her time in the spotlight and everything. We could still potentially go to Agrabah. I really don't mind going back to Agrabah, mainly because of how massive these worlds are. We've seen the huge improvement from the Pirates of the Caribbean world. Just imagine Agrabah. Like, you know, the streets of Agrabah are actually filled with people. Maybe we can actually go inside the palace. That's one of the places we've actually never been to throughout the Kingdom Hearts series. It's always just been that small little section and the desert. However, there is actually another Aladdin movie called Aladdin and the King of Thieves, which I haven't seen yet, but I've heard from a lot of people that it's actually really good, and they could, you know, base the story off of that. But you also gotta look at how these worlds are taking place. There's almost, there's like an organization member in almost every single Disney world that we have right now at the moment. So, unless the organization member is gonna think that, well, maybe we can find the black box in Agrabah, I don't really see any reason for them to be in Agrabah unless they're looking for the box because, you know, they're not after Princess Jasmine or anything like that. So, I don't know. I mean, Agrabah could be the exception. Maybe it's just going to be its own little world with, with Aladdin and Jasmine having another problem and Sora, Goofy, and Donald there to help them out and save the day. But, yeah, that is basically it for this video, guys. Agrabah, will it make its return in Kingdom Hearts 3? I was really confident that it would, but the way things are working out now, I'm starting to think that it might not actually return. If it does return, cool but if not then you know it's kind of understandable we got a lot of things going on here in Finn this game and the more did say he wants to focus a lot more on newer worlds and he did say that there aren't too many worlds left to go ahead and reveal so oh man I don't know will Agrabah make the cut are two old Disney worlds enough so guys I want to know in the comment section below is, you know what do you think do you think Agrabah will make its appearance in Kingdom Hearts 3 or do you think Agrabah is gonna pass on this round so guys if you like this video make sure to give it a big thumbs up as it really helps me out and if you're not already follow me on Twitter it's the same thing as my YouTube channel, which is Ed the Wiz. So until next time, guys, I'm going to go ahead and say, bye, pal.